Are you going to Brenner? Why, of course I am. I couldn't miss breakfast for dinner at the Yummy Broken Egg Cafe. Oh, yeah, Sarah. Last one, there's a rotten egg. <laughs> All right, 6 p.m. today. <laughs> All right, Savannah, shut your mouth. Let's get into news. Today, today is the last day to help out the London Paul Club by donating items for the Humane Society. Look for the donation bins outside of Mrs. Obremski's room, room 2081, outside of guidance and in the comments for items to donate chance to grab a cool gift for, well, anyone you want to buy a present for. The art department presents I Don't Know. Well, here we are again, the giving season. How many times have you asked someone what they want and their response is, I don't know? Or how many times have you responded, I don't know? Well, look no further, because you can get just what you're asking for, I don't know. In each package, you will receive a large shape, a medium-sized shape, and two long, smaller shapes. With these, you can color them, you can paint them, you can assemble them. But in the end, what do you get? Well, I don't know. But that's what you asked for, and it's available for you today. So, come. Grab your, I don't know, today. Purchasing an I don't know is more than getting a piece of art. It creates publicity for artists and gives them the ability to be creative with ideas. Each sale goes towards students and their creative visual art skills. So get in that holiday spirit and get yourself an I don't know. You can contact Mr. Helming for more info. Now let's toss it over to Sarah with Trending Today. Jay-Z is back on Spotify. The rapper who turned 50 last Wednesday resold all of his music to the streaming platform. Spotify then released a statement that said, Happy birthday, Hav. Welcome back to Spotify. Although it should be noted that Jay-Z owns the rival streaming service title, which totally doesn't exist. Now back to your meetings. Do you like pancakes, waffles, or eggs? If so, come out to support your NHS News and Millstream at the Broken Egg Cafe, December 6th from 6 to 8 p.m. This will be a Brenner. If you don't know what that is, that's breakfast for dinner. So if you wake up late or just like breakfast 24 seven, then this is your time to shine. We will also have a raffle basket to enter and some cool gifts for the holiday season on sale. Come out and show your support for the NHS, and NHS News and Millstream. Wow, that was some good reading. Only two best friends could do news together that well. Yep, only two good friends. Yep, let's just toss it over to sports and lunches. <laughs> Welcome to Fine Arts Friday. Let's kick it off with news, followed by Artist of the Week. Congratulations to all the band students that have been performing in various concerts over the past week. Also, good luck and make sure to come out and see the NHS Wind Ensemble as they perform at East Middle School two times tonight. Good job to the NHS singers who had their performance on Wednesday. Oh, hey NHS! Didn't see you there. I um, uh, just wanted to come out and invite you all to come to the NHS Choir Concert, uh, winter finale if you, if you so call it. <laughs> um, December 14th, it's a Saturday, there's a 2 p.m. and a 7 p.m. show. So buy your tickets online or buy them at the door. It's gonna be a good show. I guess I 
started singing when um, uh, my older brother actually joined choir and I thought it was pretty cool so I decided to hop on the old bandwagon there and start singing. I've been I'm a three-year member of the NHS Singers. Um, I, I played piano for quite a while. My mom taught me lessons for a while, but now I just started improvising on my own and whatnot. When I am on your shoulders, you raise me up to more than I can be. The arts to me are sort of a form of transcendentalization to help me kind of get away from the world and just think about life and just relax. Yeah. The only thing cuter than me is Baby Yoda. Have a great weekend, NHS. Yeah! Welcome to the Salty Sports Platoon. How tough are you? Um, I ate a bowl of nails for breakfast today. Yeah, so? Without any milk. Alrighty then, let's read some sports. Your girls' basketball teams traveled to the defending state champion HSC Royals on Wednesday night. JV battled hard but sadly fell short, losing 44-35. to Varsity followed them and lost to Hamilton Southeastern with a score of 51-32. to if you want to come support the girls' basketball team, check them out in their next game at Homestead High School on Saturday. JV starts at 1, with varsity to follow at 2.30. On December 3rd, your NHS girls' varsity swim team defeated the Franklin Central Flash as 115-71 at home. The Millers picked up several first-place finishes in the meet, highlighted by the 200 medley relay, the 200 freestyle relay, and the 400 freestyle relay. Your boys varsity swim team were defeated by Franklin Central Flash's 97-83 at home also on Tuesday. Cameron Kramer led the Millers with the first place finishes in the 200 individual medley and the 100 butterfly. Andy Buna added in a first place finish in the 100 backstroke and the 200 freestyle relay team of Justin Du Bois, Joseph Gassensmith, Ty Cox, and Isaac Steffen brought home a first place finish as well. And now over to Will with Pro Sports. Welcome to Pro Sports, where you can get all your Pro Sports news. On Wednesday, your unranked Purdue Boilermakers faced off against 5th ranked Virginia and didn't just win, but won by 29 points with a final score of 69 to 40. That's all your Pro Sports. Now back to Zach with your local sports. Your Miller Girls dance team is hosting a fundraiser this Monday at the Noblesville Culver's from 5 to 8 p.m. Come out and eat dinner at Culver's and a percentage of your purchase will go towards the fabulous dance team to help cover their competition costs. Come out and support these Miller Girls as they head into competition season. If there's a Jay-Z, does that then imply the existence of a J-A through Y as well? We don't talk about them. Why? because all 25 of them are problems, and Jay-Z isn't one. Where are the other 74? Have a fantastic Friday, NHS, and don't forget to come out to get Brinner at another broken egg tonight and support your NHS journalism programs.